Droid. Hello and welcome to DroidXForums.com video tutorial guide on how to use Gingerbrake to root your Motorola Droid X. The first thing we will need to do is go to the settings menu. Then scroll down to applications. Check unknown sources and press OK. Then tap development and check USB debugging and press OK. Now we will need to download the Gingerbrake APK. I choose to use Opera as my web browser as it has much better download capabilities than the stock browser. So we'll launch Opera and we're going to Google Gingerbrake 1.2. The very first search result should be forum.xda-developers.com. That is the Gingerbreak forum page. Once the forum thread loads, you will see a lot of information that you are more than welcome to read through. However, what we are after is at the bottom of the first post. Here you see the attached files. We have Gingerbake version 1, version 1.1, and version 1.2. We want version 1.2, so I will tap on it, and a download file dialog will open. I'll tap save, and then tap open. Android is now asking if we wish to install this application, and we do, so we click on install. Once the application is installed, tap open, and Gingerbrake is going to remind you that you have to have an SD card inserted to the phone and mounted, and USB debugging is enabled. We tap OK, and then we simply have to tap Root Device. The exploit is now running and will take about 3 to 5 minutes in order to complete, during which time your phone will reboot once. As this process does take a few minutes, I'm going to skip to the end to when the phone is already rebooted. Now that the process is complete, we open up the app drawer. We can scroll down, and under the S's we have a super user. The super user icon means that your phone has been successfully rooted. This concludes the video tutorial on using Gingerbrake to root your Motorola Droid X. I hope that you found this video very informative and helpful. And if you need any more help, you can always visit us at www.droidxforums.com. Thank you, and have a good day.